Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> We're trying to be quiet because anytime someone hears us talking, she runs over. Sophie loves jumping in bed first thing in the morning yes. as soon as she hears movement. <laughs> And so I'm shocked that she hasn't jumped up yet. I think she hears us. I did tell her to go back to bed because I did move and she came over right away. Can we see her? She's in bed. Sophie. Oh, she, uh, she came on your side. Uh, Come here. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. Sophie. Hi. Mm. She's looking at the camera. Today is all about you, Sophie. All about you how do you feel do you like it being about you yes yes <laughs> she just wants loving hi oh goodness well like we said today is going to be all about sophie mm -hmm. and what her a day in her life is like this is how her day starts jumping in bed to get the lovings and get all the lovings oh my goodness she's you about to fall over spoiled little thing Anyway, so this is how she starts her day. Okay, it's really hard to film because look at her. She just like wants to be loved. All right, well, we're gonna love her for a little bit. And then after that, we are gonna let her outside. Mm -hmm. And she loves the P word and she knows where, what that means. And so well, I'll show y'all. The P word is potty. All right, she's still chill. <laughs> All right, so let us give her some loving and then we'll start filming right after. Hi, Sophie. All right, are you ready to go potty? You ready to go potty? <laughs> oh, exactly what that means. Go potty? oh, she's so smart. Oh, you're so excited to potty. Go potty. Go, Sophie. Sophie's out there using the restroom, and usually we leave the door cracked like this. She can just push it open and come right on in. Oh, oh she's back! Hi! Girl. Hi, girl! Girl! Yeah, good girl! You're such a good girl! So here Sophie Girl is laying right outside the bathroom while uh, Cole is in there. <laughs> she just loves being close by no matter what we're doing. So we're finally all ready to go. Let's go! And home girl is ready too. I think she knows when it's time. She knows when the transfer is coming. You ready? You ready? You ready, little one? Well, oh, you ready? You ready? Oh my goodness. Mm. Yeah. She's like, come on, Dad, get up already. <laughs> I'm ready for my W. Sophie, <laughs> get up here. Do you know what time it is? It's W time. Sophie, thank <laughs> you. <laughs> All right, this is when Sophie gets real serious because she knows what's coming the vest and she knows she's got to behave but she wants to because we're about to go on a walk come on here sit are you ready <laughs> you pull your paws back what is she doing oh my goodness Sophie you <laughs> have somebody Sophie, stand. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Are you ready? Here we go. So this is something we do every day. It's about a mile and a half walk I take Sophie on. Uh, she knows our route very well by now. Sometimes wants to lead the way and I have to remind her back and then she comes and gets back beside me again. She just loves her walks. And it's a great way for us to work on uh, distractions with her because she does uh, have a bit of attention deficit where she's looking around a lot when there's squirrels and stuff, but she's gotten really good at maybe looking at them, but not it, like going towards them, acknowledging them. I'll go on the walk with y'all as a silent cameraman. All right, this is a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day.
So we've talked about how skittish Sophie can be. Like she jumps at the wind sometimes, literally. On our first few walks, she would always jump at this point when she'd look over and see that in the yard. It's a goat. It's just like a statue and she would freak out for like two weeks. And then finally, I guess she got over it. She realized it's not moving anywhere. back from our walks we take the vest off we give her some luncheon and we usually do keep her vest off when we're at home she still needs to be in service mode and in a responsive mode if we ever give her a command she needs to know whether the vest is on or off that she has to respond to that command sit free oh i forgot oh forgot the collar uh oh she's probably confused <laughs> Good job, Sophie. Yay. Good girl. Grab. Sophie, grab. Sophie, grab. Good girl. Hold it. Hold. Here. Ah. Hold. Here. Sophie, here. Good girl. Good girl. Good job, Sophie. Yay! You did it. Good Still girl. a challenge with things like her vest. <laughs> Good girl. Good job, Sophie. All right, let's get your lunch. Are you ready for your lunch? Actually, we call it dinner. Sophie, you ready for your dinner? You ready for your dinner? Oh, there's no dinner in there, but I'll make it. Okay. <laughs> so it's about time to eat lunch. Um, we usually make Sophie girls lunch first, mm -hmm. and then we eat our lunch because she starts smelling our lunch, and she's like, I want some food. Mm, yeah. So we make hers first. We call it dinner, so she knows what dinner means. But yeah, so we are partnering with Farmer's Dog, so thank you for sponsoring this video. Mm -hmm. As many of you know, Sophie is so picky when it comes to food. And yeah. so we finally took the time to invest in better dog food for her. So it's fresh dog food. We know she loves fresh food, but I just wasn't in the mood to cook her food all the time. Mm -hmm. So it's a home delivery food service for dogs that you can have delivered right to your home. And we want to keep Sophie around for a long time. You know, she's almost two in April and we want to have her forever. So one way to keep her around longer and healthy um, is by investing in better food for her. And we discovered that a lot of these dog foods are super highly processed. Mm -hmm. And like when you're feeding your dog, you smell it yourself and like you're wondering what could be in that food. Mm -hmm. With the farmer's dog, you smell it and you can see that it is real food. It's made fresh and delivered right to your door so it's super convenient mm -hmm. and it's pre-portioned for your dog so you never have to worry about if you're overfeeding your dog yeah so they ask you the weight of the dog and so they send you exactly what you need and tell you how much to feed your dog which is perfect mm -hmm. so since giving sophie the farmer's dog we've noticed she gets so much more excited about dinner mm -hmm. like we were saying earlier she is so picky and it would take a long time for us to even get her to eat her food mm -hmm. but with farmer's dog she smells and she gets so excited and she runs over oh, and yeah. she chows down she loves it and we know that the farmer's dog can be a little bit more expensive than mm -hmm. traditional dog foods but we feel like it's worth the investment for Sophie's health her well-being and for our future so if y'all are interested in getting the farmer's dog for your lovely pets mm -hmm. use the link in the description for 60% off your first order thank you for watching again thank you farmer's dog for sponsoring mm -hmm. this video Thanks. okay let's get Sophie getting so excited Oh, look who's back in the Are you done? Were you playing outside? Good girl. So earlier she had to use the restroom and she told Cole, we always leave the door cracked for her to come in, like we said earlier, and she came on in. She lets us know by jumping up and pawing at us. And that's, that's her way. And usually, I mean, that's how she wants to play with us too. When she's extra adamant with her paws, it's because she has to go to the bathroom. And then we say, you gotta go potty. And then she's like, oh, and then she starts running towards the door. So, good job, Sophie. Thanks for having outside. Us. I was trying to get a video of her playing outside, but then she was done by the time we got the camera ready. And then she ran and let herself in. Yep. <laughs> Did you close the door? Let's go check the door. All right, Sophie, can we close it? 
I'm gonna just close the door. Come here. Come here. Sophie here. She's not doing it. <laughs> She's not doing it. <laughs> so it is about 3 p.m. and I'm taking like a little nap, like resting, and Sophie Girl always comes up because she wants her loving. I'm crying. Are you crying? Why are you crying? Oh, oh. I'm sorry, Sophie. You want a nap too? All right, lay down. <laughs> We're gonna nap. So usually we um, rest and it's Sunday and so I'm a little bit more lazy on Sundays. All right, nap time. Say goodnight, Sophie. Tell everyone to go take a nap and then we'll resume later. Are you cuddling, here? Mama? Are you cuddling down here now? Put your head down. There you go. Yay! There you go. Mm, so cute. <laughs> so cute. Wait, all the paws together. Alright, team on three. One, two, three, team! <laughs> this is a regular part of our day as well with Sophie, where I come out to my office and I do a bit of work. And while I work, she lounges and she gets to relax and she's very good at that. When she lays down in the bed for too long, she gets really hot, so she actually prefers the cold ground, apparently. And she just likes to be close, as close as possible. <laughs> Very close, you cute. Something else we do with Sophie when we come outside, we do a little driveway sprint action. She loves to run, and she loves going to her mama. So we'll show you how this is done. Get cold. Good job, Sophie. Come here. Good girl. Sophie, mama. Sophie, mama. <laughs> You're so fast, Sophie. You're the fast girl. You're the fast girl. <laughs> it's after dinner, and I think Sophie knows what's coming. You see this? I got my active hands on. This is what I use to grip things since I don't have grip function. And we have to do our daily routine of maintenance. You ready to get your hair brushed? Yeah, you wanna high five? Hey, hey, so high five. Yeah, good job. What's that? Do you want it? Do you want the brush? You want the brush? Yes, yes. All right, get over here. Good girl. <laughs> oh, she loved the brushing time. <laughs> She's so happy. You're so happy, Sophie. She gets so fluffy afterwards, too. Even her beard needs to get a little brushing. She, that's the one part she doesn't like because you brush her beard. <laughs> this is also a good arm workout by the end of this. Is it? I'm a little tired. <laughs> Sophie must have wanted this part of her brush because she just jumped up in my lap. She's putting herself in the best position for you. Yes, how kind. Look at me. What? Is there a hair on my face? I can feel it. Uh, oh, sorry. Wait, wait, let me see. Did I get it? Did I blow again? You got it. Can you help me? You got it, you got okay, it. Okay, thank you. To twist the brush around in my hand, I have to bite it, and last time I got a chunk of hair. <laughs> Yum. Yum. Did she hold her head up for you? Claire. Higher, higher, higher. Oh. Hi. <laughs> I love this dog. I love this doggo. Hold on. I know where you want to be. Go ahead. Come on. There you go. <laughs> That's her favorite spot. When it comes to Sophie's training, uh, one of the biggest things we've been working on is her with her distractions. Like we mentioned on the walk, like she gets really distracted. And that's been a challenge because with COVID, we don't really go out into public a lot. We don't get to do a lot of training with her in that arena. But something that we've gotten really good at is picking things up and carrying them to me. So now, especially with her toys, we started with her toys. So she's gotten really good at like the end of the night, we'll have her go pick up her toy and it'll bring it to me and I can put it in the basket. And it's helpful because she brings like 80 toys out of her basket <laughs> and leaves them right in front of the door. So we're, we're continuing to find things uh, for her to learn and we're continuing to teach ourselves how to train Sophie because n neither of us are dog trainers. We're just two people who want 
a very well-trained doggy. Anyway, this is the end of our day. We had a pretty good day. So does Sophie, she comes, she's coming to tell you she had a good day. Sophie, you ready to go potty? Ready to go potty? Yeah. All right, go potty. Go potty, girl. Go potty, Sophie, go ahead. I need to wash her blankie. I'm gonna do that tomorrow and do all the laundry, but she sleeps there with her little blankie. Obviously, because it says Sophie Station. Sophie Station. <clears throat> she loves being right next to us, as, long, as close as she can be. Do I have another hair on my lip? No. I feel something. You don't. Okay. I carry Sophie with me everywhere I go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so once she's done putting, we let her in and she goes straight, straight to her bed. And she loves bedtime. She does. Like she, she wants to go to bed way earlier than we go. As soon as like it's eight o'clock, she wants to go to bed. She gets so irritated when we're doing our nightly chores, getting ready for bed ourselves, because we'll make a move towards the hallway, and she just like is anticipating us going to the bedroom, so she'll get up and then run into the bedroom, and then when we don't go down the hallway, she comes and peeks around the corner, and then she comes and jogs back, and then she lays down again until we make another move, and then she gets up and runs to the bedroom. Yes, <laughs> yeah. All right, so if you were coming, just give us a minute. Yes. So she's out there doing her thing. Once she's done. Cole and I will get in bed and then it'll be bedtime for all of us. Yeah, we got a big day tomorrow. Yes, we do. Is she gonna sleep with us forever and always? I think so. If I had my way, she'd sleep in bed with us, but. You don't have your way. I don't have my way. <laughs> <laughs> no, she just ran back to the backyard. She's playing. Did she? Yeah. I just saw her trot by. <laughs> oh my goodness. She's I think having... she, pretty sure she had a stick in her mouth. She's playing with her ball. Look at her. Oh, the wind's freaking her out. Here she is. You all done? Come on. Good girl. girl. You all done? You all done? You have fun out there? All, all right. right. Go to bed. Do what you do best. You gotta clean yourself. Ugh, gross. <laughs> Every time she comes in, she gotta make sure she's nice and clean. Grossy. Oh, she laid down. She got embarrassed. <laughs> you embarrassed her. Do you, okay, let's get that, let's get you all clean for the camera. You look a mess. Oh, 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 come on, come on. Oh my God, Sophie. <laughs> Sophie, stop it. Okay, do you want to say bye to the camera? Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you had fun with me today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and stay oh. positive. Yeah, good job. Good job, girl. Give me five. Good job. Yay! <laughs> Bye guys, say bye-bye! Bye! Sophie? Sophie? Where'd you go, Sophie? Oh! oh, oh we Sophie! Were hiding? What were you doing? Were you hiding? Were you hiding in there? What in the world? Oh my goodness. <laughs>